Today, we're diving into the realm of toilet paper, a remarkable invention that once filled a role held by seashells. In 5th century BC China, people used bamboo pieces and ceramics as toilet paper, but they lacked the extensive coverage needed for households today. However, in contemporary times, toilet paper is not merely practical, it has also found its place in challenges and pranks. Join us as we explore the origin of this essential invention, uncovering the narrative behind the soft white paper patented by New Yorker Joseph Gaetti. Before we dive into that, make sure to follow us for engaging content that satisfies your curiosity about the production process, and don't forget to hit the like button on the video. Now we're going to step into the Middle Ages. People sought softer alternatives, using linen or cotton pieces for personal hygiene. It wasn't until the 18th century that things got interesting in the United States, with newspapers and magazines playing a role in the world of toilet paper. It might not have been the most hygienic choice, but it was a start. Fast forward to the 19th century, and here comes Joseph Gaetti, an American innovator who changed the game. In 1857, he introduced the first roll of toilet paper, consisting of 100 sheets each proudly labeled Gaetti's medicated paper. But hold on, the real breakthrough happened in the 1880s with the Scott brothers, who took toilet paper to a whole new level, softer and more affordable. As the 20th century rolled in, toilet paper became a household essential. By the 1920s, it had become the go-to product for personal hygiene in the United States. Now, let's talk about the swinging 60s, where toilet paper saw quality and variety innovations. Two-ply and three-ply options hit the market, and suddenly colored and patterned toilet paper became a thing. Following the resolution of the minor toilet paper panic in 1973, triggered by a late night joke from Johnny Carson, it stands as a humorous reminder of the unpredictable influence of comedy on consumer behavior. Now let's continue on with our journey. Cut to the present day, where toilet paper is a global necessity. The materials used in its production are even becoming more sustainable. Some brands are going green by using recycled paper. It's a small step, but every bit counts. And finally, it's time to dive into the journey we're here for. How is this product, encountered daily throughout our lives, manufactured? Our journey starts with the collection of wood, using a powerful 18-ton harvester. This versatile machine works wonders, efficiently felling, delimbing, and sawing up trees. Equipped with a saw and curved knives, this harvester is like a master swordsman in the forest, selectively targeting undesirable wood trunks for toilet paper production, specifically those that are crooked or defective. Now, once we have our harvest, it's time for meticulous processing. Machines are used to strip the bark from softwood and hardwood trees during the preparation process, aiming to preserve as much wood as feasible. And here comes the giant wood chipper, a true powerhouse that reduces the wood to small chips. These chips undergo a thorough cleaning process, including bark removal and elimination of impurities like stones and debris. Because obviously we want our toilet paper to be as pure as possible. Afterward, they proceed to the factory for their transformation. These trunks are designed to undergo processing into pulp, the essential raw material for our beloved toilet paper. Then starts the world of chemical transformation and pulp manufacturing. These chips are about to undergo a remarkable chemical conversion within our state-of-the-art decomposers. Through a series of chemical reactions, wood chips are transformed into delicate cellulose fibers, the foundation of what we now know as pulp. Now let's move on to the next stage. We're bringing these wood chips into large containers, and this is where the real transformation takes place. Chemicals are deployed to disintegrate the wood chips into fine fibers, creating the pulp that's so crucial in paper Production. Now, imagine these batches of wood chips undergoing a chemical cooking process that lasts several hours. It's like a culinary masterpiece, but for creating pulp. During this time, the wood moisture is evaporated and the mass is transformed into cellulose fibers, lignin, the adhesive that binds fibers together and other essential elements. What emerges from this intricate process is a usable fiber known as pulp. These cellulose fibers are the building blocks of paper. The combination of strength and flexibility makes them perfect for crafting a wide range of paper products. And by now, aren't you curious about the journey of recycled toilet paper? Let's talk about it. Recycled paper a vital ingredient in the production of environmentally friendly toilet paper isn't just any paper. Initially, waste paper is gathered and subjected to sorting. A sorting machine meticulously distinguishes usable recycled paper from other materials. Think of it as like a superhero for the environment, ensuring that only the highest quality recycled paper makes it through to the next stage. Now, a carefully selected recycled paper then embarks on a journey to the paper plant mill. This is where the real transformation takes place. The recycled paper undergoes pulping, a process 
process that breaks it down into fibers. Following that, it undergoes filtration and refining, meticulously eliminating any impurities, reborn as a result in the creation of pulp, ready for use for eco-friendly individuals. Either recycled paper or pulp converted from wood undergoes a thorough cleansing in a large washing machine, with 14 stations to eliminate impurities. Subsequently, the pulp is treated with a bleaching process, using a combination of bleach and water. In the next phase, the treated pulp enters a massive paper machine, a high-tech contraption orchestrating the creation of solid paper through forming, pressing, drying, and crimping stages. This incredible paper machine takes the watery pulp and transforms it into a seamless paper web, employing spraying, pressing, drying, and ironing techniques, and the result, a continuous paper web that gracefully winds onto a colossal jumbo reel in a short time. Generously mixed with water gives birth to paper stock, gracefully sprayed onto mesh screens for a water-draining spectacle. Following our press, our paper ventures into a drying phase, a zone where heat works its magic, transforming it into a seamless dry paper sheet. Carefully scraped off by metal blades, it embraces the embrace of jumbo reels, making its way to machines that carve it into long strips and punctuate it into squares. Stay with me now for the most mesmerizing part of our paper production process. After this phase, the paper takes a journey through creping, a delightful process that adds softness and a charming, slightly wrinkled look. To perfect the finish, iron rollers gratefully sweep away any lingering creases from the paper sheet. Our paper embarks on a journey into the toilet paper rolling machine. The precision of our winding technique ensures the creation of multiple layers, each adorned with its unique surfaces, depending on the manufacturer. To secure these layers seamlessly, a special adhesive is meticulously applied, followed by the intricate perforation process. Watch as the paper is elegantly wound around jumbo reels, ready to be transported to cutting machines that skillfully turn it into long strips and perforate it into convenient squares. Once the rolls are perfected, they go through a process of being cut into various sizes, expertly perforated, meticulously packaged, and bundled into multi-packs. And now these toilet paper rolls are ready to hit the market. From the amusing toilet paper panic in 1973 to its surprising transformations into artistic creations and luxury experiences, this mundane product has proven to be more than meets the eye. And that concludes the incredible journey of one of our everyday essentials, toilet paper.